Yo, everybody, how you doing today? <laughs> okay, so, uh, yeah, so last episode was a little, uh, <laughs> something. Uh, <laughs> hopefully, uh, I don't, you know, spiral into a depression like last episode, because, uh, <laughs> yeah, no, I, 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 okay, let's just do this one, I guess? I have Ooh. 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 Music be gone. Oh god, no, not these. Wait, hold on, I missed something. Oh, never mind. It wasn't a coin, my sniffer's all wrong. Okay, no, we're, we're doing a lot better than- No, I'm not gonna get cocky, stop, shush. Oh, uh, uh, what button was that again? <laughs> that one. Go up. Oh, wait. Oh, are these directional ones? Oh my god, these are directional ones. Neat. Okay, death. Got it, cool. So, um, yeah, last episode was certainly something. Um, but yeah, from last episode, I got some pretty funny stuff that's been happening in my, uh, life, such as- Oh. Such as gaslighting, everybody's favorite thing. Come on, you gotta admit, you like gaslighting, huh? Yeah, no, I know you do. You love gaslighting so much. Yeah, so, um, yeah, I have a funny little story that happened in the interim from last episode to this episode. Such as me gaslighting somebody. Um, yeah, so at work, I... Mm, uh, at work, I have a person I work with. I'm not gonna name names, because again, none of you guys wouldn't even know the name anyways, but... Um, yeah, so I work with somebody, and they have a tendency to, like, just love gaslighting people. I don't know why. It, I guess, is a hobby for him. Uh, um, but he loves to gaslight me the most, because you know why? I'm extremely gullible. I'm like a newborn child to him. Maybe that's wrong, I don't know. Up. Oh, oh, shoot. No, nope, we're not gonna let that get to us. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. Uh, yeah, so he loves gaslighting me, and I... And whatever I tell him that he gaslight... No, wait, hold on. I need momentum. There we go. Yeah, whenever I even tell him, Oh, man, you gaslight me all the time. Can you please stop? And he's, he gaslights me about me gaslighting him. Which he says, and I quote, I don't gaslight you. Tell me one time that I gaslight you, because I do not gaslight you. Even though he does it literally all the time. So, as a little uh, gaff, I needed to get back at this man. Oh, I needed to get back at him so hard. So, I decided, hey, why don't I try and gaslight him? So, this was <laughs> this is what I gaslighted him about. So, I had to take a day off because... Uh, I had to take a day off because I had like a doctor's appointment. I, I, I had a doctor's and dentist appointment to get to. So I had to take a Monday off, which I made him take my shift, thank god. Um, and then after I had to take a week off, which... Wait, when is this 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 is coming out on Wednesday, so... Next week, I'm gonna be off on vacation. Um, so yeah, hopefully it's nice. Um, but uh, yeah, so I'm gonna be off on vacation, so I had to book an entire week off. And he was there whenever I booked that week off, so he knows about it. So, what I decided to... Mm, what I decided to do was tell a little fib and tell him, um, well, he asked me, first of all, why I needed the, um, why I needed the, uh, Monday off, which I told him, oh, yeah, I need it because I'm waiting for a package. Uh, I wasn't, it was for a doctor's. Um, and to make it seem more funny, I was like, oh, yeah, no, I'm waiting for a mail order bride to come in. <laughs> And then he started asking questions, and every single question he asked, I had a somewhat reasonable explanation for it. Uh, dang it. I need to keep my momentum. Um, I had a somewhat reasonable explanation for it, such as, oh yeah, about the mail order bride thing. Yeah, I ordered her, she's coming on Monday, uh, I had to wait for her at the airport and stuff like that, because I need to be there to, like, let her in and blah blah blah. 
Um, and after he kept asking questions like, oh, is the people you're living with okay with this? I'm like, yeah, they're fine. We already have a room for her and stuff. And after, um, I think this is the reason why he believed me so much. Is because, um, damn. This is hard. Um, is because that week-long vacation, I haven't told him that I was taking a vacation yet. I said, oh yeah, that week I took off? Yeah, that's for the honeymoon that we're going on. <laughs> and then after, at that point, he just ate out of my hand. He believed every single word I said. I said, oh yeah, it, I went for the most, more expensive per, I went for the more expensive wife, uh, because I went for a Japanese wife, because the reason why it's more expensive is because I had to pay for the flighting tickets, which cost around like a couple thousand dollars. Can I, can I get up? Can I get up? Can I get up? There we go. To us in a couple thousand dollars, and that's why they're so, that's why Japanese people are so expensive to get. Um, this sounds really wrong. It seems like I'm doing something else, but I'm not, I swear. Um, and after he's like, oh yeah, no, that's reasonable. Am I, uh, invited to the wedding? And he's like, no, you're not only close family, because, hey, I don't have that much money for a wedding, so only close family and friends. I'm sorry. Um, and yeah, so then, after all of that, he started telling quite literally everybody at work that, oh yeah, no, uh, Flobo? Yeah, they're, uh, they're getting a male or a bride. And I, and they started asking me questions too. So eventually, this started getting out of hand, because now my managers are starting to know, my co-workers that I'm working with, even people, like, people like my, some of my work friends, um, oh, wait, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, so my work friends, for some reason, they weren't working that day. Like, work friends from other, like, locations, like, um, that, not even my work location, but, like, other, fran like, branches came in that I knew, and they s started telling them about how I got a mail order bride and stuff like that, and I'm getting married tomorrow, technically. And, um... Yeah, so this started getting really out of hand, <laughs> and, um, yeah, I don't know what I'm gonna tell him, because I would just- Oh, hey, mole man. Um, yeah, I don't know what I'm gonna tell him that it was- I was gaslighting him. I'm just gonna wait until he eventually starts to realize that I'm gaslighting him. Was he there the entire time? Nah, nah, mm, no, no. Mm. I, I'm, I'm gonna choose to say no, but maybe. So, yeah, I'm just gonna leave it like that. I'm just gonna leave it there. I want to see how long it's gonna take him to realize that, um, yeah, no, he's getting lit. He's getting such, he's getting gaslit. Oh, 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 cold water, okay. Um. Does staying in, oh, the staying in the snow doesn't make me cold, but the water does. Mmm, some- that logic. Uh, so yeah, I'm just gonna leave it there. <laughs> See how long it's gonna take. Um, I'm gonna tell everybody else that, uh, isn't him. That, um, yeah, no, I was just lying and I was trying to gaslight him. But, uh, yeah, so that made kind of an awkward- conversation to some managers and stuff like that because again like the head managers and stuff now think that for some reason I ordered a mail order bride and I don't know if I should be offended because they believed it and they believed that I would order a wife from the mail I don't know if I should take offense to that tell me in the comments all right would you take offense if people would assume that you would actually order a mail order bride Right? No? Maybe? But, uh, yeah, then after, like, he kept on asking more questions, like, Oh, yeah, um, do you even know what she looks like? And I'm like, oh, yeah, no, we, uh, of course, I have to, like, do video calls and stuff with her and stuff like that. And, this is kind of, <laughs> I had to do video calls and stuff. So, of course, I know what she looks like, and, oh, do you even know, does she know what you look like? I'm like, yes. Again, I don't know if he was trying to, like, say something about that, like, I don't look that bad, um, <laughs> but, um, yeah, let's just go down here real quick, I haven't gotten a single coin on this level, hmm, 
I guess my sniffer's not going that well. Uh, what was that? How did I do that? Wait, what? 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 No. Okay. Come on, come on, closer. No. Yep. Yeah, here we go. Oh, oh, it's the drill. It's the drill. Flying people. Okay. No. Oh, no, 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 no. Get up, get up, get up. Bad. Ow, 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 ow. Don't die, don't die. Eh. Yeah, it's these people. No, not these people. These things. What are these things? Can I... Ah. Oh. Wait, hold on. How do I... No, hey, stop it. Where do I go? <laughs> I'm confused. Oh, I only have one life. Okay, um, I didn't realize how close to death I was. Oopsie. Oh, I go up. Oh, yeah, of course. You just looked, Lolo. Can I... Wait. Wait. Okay. Oh. Okay. <laughs> eh. There we go. Is this the end of the level? Yeah! 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 No coins. I'm assuming they were down below, like deep within the earth of the cr the crust of the earth. Ooh, wait, hold on, what's new? What's new? New hats? No. It. No. Okay. Nothing new. I might as well buy some of these. Actually, no, I just need to do that. Okay, there we go. There we go. Um, yeah, no, we, we can we can do another one. It's fine. It's, we, might, we might go above 15 minutes, but Pepper Grinder videos do good as it is. What's going on here? Ooh. Hello. Oh, hi. That giant seems nice. I like him. <laughs> Pyramid head? What's going on? Alright, time to... Eh. There we go. Still wish I had my gun. Okay. Okay, yep. There we go. Get up here. Ow. Okay, no, we don't have to worry about them. We don't have to worry about them. They're gone. Aww. Oh, I like him. I'm gonna call you Big Joe. Big Joe. That's your name. Big Joe's nice. Nice guy, Big Joe. I've known him since uh, high school. Really nice. He used to be actually really small, but then if he hit his growth spurt around like a 12th grade. Which is kind of weird, but, um, yeah. Then after he kind of just, like, got real tall. Unfortunately for, uh... Can I not... I can't move with this? Oh. How am I... Is it like a cannon? Wait, hold on. Is there a cannon? No. How am I... Oh, wait, no, I can move. No, I can't. Oh! Ah! Oh. Ah! Okay. Yeah, it was my own stupidity. Let's get some of these. Let's go over here. Kill them. I did that on purpose. That, do some of this, go over here like that, go whamp, and ah! Oh! Pop you out, go like this, go whamp, bonk. Alright, let's go over here. 
I sniff a coin. Well, not really sniff, I see the coin. Now I gotta go this and go get the nope. Get the coin nope. Get the coin. Ah. There we go. Oh, hi, bud. <laughs> Wait. Why is okay? You know what? No, I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna wonder. I'm not gonna wonder. Big Joe. It's personality that counts. All right. Don't don't worry about what everybody else says. You're good in my book. Does this kill them? No. But this will. There we go. Uh, ooh, this is a little more dangerous. Nope. Hey, 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 hey. Okay. Go hit that one. Hit him like so. Oh, hey, get back, you. Hit this one like so. Oh, and boom. Now we, we don't have to do that one. Yeah, we just skip it. It's fine. Uh, there we go. There we go. There we go. Oh, didn't even see that. Great. Oh. Man, I love this guy. Big Joe. Bi big. Fan fit. Oh, dang. I only got one again. My sniffer. Okay. I'm going to leave this episode here. Thank you guys very much for watching me. Uh, say hi to Big Joe in the comments. Uh, he deserves it. See you guys later.